At Microsoft, we filed this case over four years ago in 2013, and the day we filed it, we said that we were prepared to take this case all the way to the Supreme Court if that's what it took to protect the privacy of our customers around the world. Here we are today on the steps of the Supreme Court, having made our argument to the nine justices. I certainly come out of the courthouse, if anything, more encouraged than when we walked in this morning. Because, in fact, I think that what this case makes clear and what this morning has further made clear is that we need 21st century laws to protect 21st century technology. This case is fundamentally about a law that was passed across the street in Congress in 1986. It is a law that was never intended to reach around the world or into our data center in Ireland. As I think the oral argument made abundantly clear, there are a variety of factors, important nuances that need to be considered in order to ensure that law enforcement can do its job and people's privacy rights can be protected. And there is only one institution in this country that can balance all of the careful nuances that need to be considered. That institution is across the street, it is in our Capitol building, it is in the United States Congress. I think it's important that even the justices reflected on the fact that there is now bipartisan legislation pending before Congress. They talk specifically about the Cloud Act. It seems to be the one thing that we can all agree on, that we need Congress to move and we need Congress to move now.